fast. After that, we can get the triangle. After triangle, we can go for a square. Triangle square skull. A melee, you probably don't even want to be attacking the skull, to be honest. Bones regen. Just leave up the pit. There's an eradicator you can hit. First care of the big guy. We'll be pulling these guys back to where we just fought everything. That said, our healer man is around 50%. Let's give them a couple of more ticks of their use. Alright, we're pulling it back into the previous room, so everyone step on back. And let's make sure we're detecting magic. Cross and mortal strike, we can go for the cross first. There is a fire and arcane reflect. I don't know which one that is yet, though. And the shadow and frost reflect. Any ideas which ones? Because I can't change my card right now. Okay. 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 I don't speak at fucking once. Okay. Alright, we go for square next. Okay. Left half push. Cool, keep moving away, we kill moon lads. We'll be stacking up on moon, yeah. You heard the man, start fucking talking more. Alright, everyone, to get deep into moon. Make sure you get inside of its range very quickly. Oh, nice, quick and easy. Right, we have one more eradicated to kill. Then everyone's going to be popping an arcane protection potion. We're going to get ready to pull in the boss. I'm on the right, Dreyfus on the left, Flurry's on the right, Lightning's up on the left, Mifren and Alay are on the boss. Your greater arcane protection potion. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. So eager to die, I will... right, thanks. Pick up your target. You betray. CC flurry. Next split's about to go out. Next split again, focus down the real one this time, that's one marked with the square above its head. All damage in swim. Power enchant, and none of these items are SR. Um, Gusto, I'll give you assistance. Yeah. I'll give Mishlem assistance yeah. too because I almost forgot. The disenchanter today is most likely Shira. You don't want the um, druid healing, but anything? I'd rather have the Shadow Priest Manager, especially because I'm often doing a lot of like rebuffs onto people. Oh, that's fair. All priests together strong. Right, we're pulling the back. CC flurry. 
That's not just one bump, yeah. doing one big wipe, it's normally like one or two. I'll do the AOE taunt on next pack. Right. Yeah, let's just went heating because we'll be in love and heating Yeah, I forgot about that when I was doing the assignment sheet, to be fair. That's right. Big 18. Ah oh yes, thank you for the reminder. We do a CTW check now. Make sure you have your add-on. How dare you turn my add-on for me? A piece of power, to be honest. Who do you think you are? To be fair, boy, better that the mage gets the five power enchant so he can use on his own gloves because I'm never going to use on mine. Type slash CTW to turn it off. The warriors are coming up. Check the pin messages in AQ40 if you're asking what to add on. Make sure we're AOing these down all at the same time. We want to make sure the damage is nice and spread, so warriors don't just zug zug. Cross needs a lot more damage. Kill them dead. AOE taunt. Beautiful. Alright, we jump over the edge, we pull everything under. And we focus down the big brainwasher first, and we pull these guardians straight into the edge so that when you get knocked up, you don't get knocked down the room. So be in front of the melee. And miss them if you need. By the way, I have tons of inventory space for scarabs and idols and all that good stuff. Bare space, alright man. Bare space blood. CCJC. I've got a bare space fan. Yeah, I know what you mean by bare space blood, don't worry. Funky, this old time of those is a little bit confused now. The loop, I feel. Yes. It's not me who's wrong. It's the children. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, make sure the guardians are between you and the doorway, so you don't get knocked into the room behind the poor boss. I need to go check which one. This week. We are killing them last this week. So killing them last means we kill this one first, we kill this one second, we kill this one first. Your so, um, Yao just the one that does the fear. This means we need to be on top of our tremor totems for most of this fight until we have killed the big blue guy. Kree is the one doing poison, so we need to make sure we are poison cleansing as priority one until Kree is dead. Oh yeah. Thanks for dickers. That was very Oh good. yeah. Right. Hey man, it was ugly on my raid frames. Cool. So everyone make sure you get to your full mana, we're going to be nuking down Kree. Since Kree dies and goes into a poison ball, we need to make sure we kill it away from the rest of the raid group. So we want to be pulling it into a corner and killing it there. Healers, make sure you're in range to heal and also dispel the poison in that meantime. Then when we're down to just Yao and Vem, we'll have an easy time because it's just fear. We're going to be pulling Vem all the way to this side of the room where these green markers are though. And um, Yao just to keep it away from the poison cloud from Kree. Just so it's very clear where I want the boss. One dies on that side, the other one's dying on this side. Let's go. Four, Wait, three, two. Okay, tanks lightens up some gouge. Funky's on wrong fucking week. <sighs> I'm on gouge. Drafer's on them. Glory's on Cree. Oh, I'm on Cree. It's alright. Cool. 
There's a sheet with it all posted. You should definitely yeah, just read it. Yeah, I didn't see it uh, on top. It's right. Oh, good. So make sure we're pulling Crete all the way to the fucking wall, not the middle of the room. Let's pull these mobs out. Interrupt the heal. Your friends will abandon you. And shamans, you need to make sure these tremor totems are in range of the melee. And your cast group if you're in the cast group. Everyone else, you're standing very close to the poison tabs. You should definitely go to the other side of the room away from it. Alright, let's kill all the ads, and then we just have to focus down then. You will die. Nice job. Zero SRs on both items again. Res are two dead. The Angelus to double. I'm going to roll for that because the stamina is quite a nice one. Rafers, you're signed up as a tank. Well, I'm the ring. Do you have the same name? Yeah, the Viscount Genesis, <laughs> yeah. yes. Cool. Mm -hmm. I like Sharky's rolling all spec for it as well. Hilarious. Fair <laughs> enough, Warriors. The Warriors are literally right here. But... Yeah, Ooh, no quick anymore. game crash. <laughs> hey, you pulled, you pulled Chase. Yeah, that's fine. We'll pick them up. Wait for the Consecrates from all of our Paladin tanks. They'll just have a stabilized threat before we start AoE. If you have aggro, pull it to the group of them. We want to be backing up into the wall, so we're just always backpedaling so we can't get on the ground room. I could have went better. Was an asshole, so fair enough. Now we should do, lads. We should get loads of bleeds, then run back in when we still put them on, so we get even more bleeds. That's a plan. Yeah, hard. How did you know that was how we planned this raid to work? Intuition. Yeah, I cannot possibly conceive of a different thing. Who <laughs> <laughs> oh, the such stupidity? We're going to be pulling the next pack. Paladins, you'll be doing your Consecrate spamming, basically. Just make sure we... It's a Warriors incoming. Yeah, I know. There they are. All right. Spread your damage. Kill them all at the exact same time. There's one Warrior not getting any love at the current time. You got AoE Torn? Nope. I'll do it. Nice. They died fucking hella quick. Yeah, they just disappeared. Right. You will die. <laughs> yeah, go for it, my friend. Oh, three artifacts already, boys. <laughs> you better be twisting, Funky. The guy has ten mana, he can't be twisting. Remember, pull these guardians around so we're having our backs to a wall, not backs to the open. Otherwise, people are just going to take a lot of full damage for no reason. Game crash real quick. Slacker. 
Uh, I think we'll explore to avoid this trash. Yeah, funky slurphead and my Brexit geezer voice. Like, iconic <laughs> means of murder bit. Oh. Alright, can we actually wait for people to get rest this time? Sure. Hmm. I think we Oh no. But the rate goes down if you pull with more people dead, that's how it works, right? And they've had their chance, me from go for it. Everyone else, why are you following? Have we got some brain damage? It's fun. We got some dent. I'd follow though. Mithrin anywhere. I thought it might be just be different this week. You know? <laughs> oh, huh. Will explode. All right, what we're gonna do is just gonna pull them off one at a time and just make the paladin tanks hold them. How's that sound? I don't want to pull any box off, man. I mean, I didn't know first, but it grew on me. This <laughs> inquiry is dead. Eh? We're done with the trash. Are you one pulling your tank gear equipment? Your courage. Just Your to thing. spell it out, myself, Mifrant, and Olay will be starting off on Sartora. We have Dreyfus, Flurry, and Light Nut taking triangles, cross, or skull, respectively. Triangle, cross, or skull. Cool. We're not going to be min maxing with fucking amplified magic and all that crap. It shouldn't be needed. Casters, just watch and pay attention to your feet. Make sure you're running away from shit if it's chasing after you. We're going to wait for everyone to get here down the long tunnel because we still have Lake Sharks, Eat a Res. I did get Res. I personally Res them. Lag. Oh, chestnut. And now he's released. Eve. He's here. Yep, okay, he's actually res. Cool. Once he gets here, we go in. Tanks get ready to pick up your targets. Make sure we're fighting more so in the middle of the room than near the doorway. Make sure you're spreading out and going around the room. So if people start running in on this side. Resalve the warriors. And off we go. Judge for these Once Skull is dead, whoever's tanking Skull move over and help out Cross. Once Cross is dead, you guys help out Triangle, and then you guys can come to Sartora. Need a fucking heal on JC. Just sparks can all oh, wait. <laughs> exactly. Oh wait. Alright, spam taunts. Thanks, taunt. Remember, you can use a lip to avoid the damage. <gasps> it's just physical. That's why Amplify Magic works. Beautiful, we only had four die. Zero SRs on the items against a healer loot deck. 
there it's the best tanking trinket. Oh wait. And back to normal gear. We're gonna give Mish Sam some time to finish with all the loot. And then we're all gonna group up on the star and we're gonna go through the gauntlet. We have three paladin tanks, so realistically we can just run and they can spam consecrate. Are we all done, Mr? Let's go. Just keep going forward, no need to slow down and try and kill everything. We can group all together and kill it at the end. Is it okay if Druid trade me the helmet? Yeah, you cool. yeah. Yamara? Yeah, that's fine. I just wanted to ask for. They both passed yeah. you, so like it's fine. Okay, yeah, Thanks. Question. Yeah, I wanted to ask before I just just take some items, whatever. Yeah. yeah. Want any complications? A good policy for sure. <laughs> Your ads, Yamara. Oh, thanks. Fuck up. Fast. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> it's very important. The star hasn't stopped, you guys don't stop. What do you mean slash follow? <laughs> 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 I was literally, I wasn't even having my hands on the keyboard, man. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Alright, let's get up to the safe spot. That is the wrong side, guys, sorry. Don't follow the stupid there. It's also a safe spot. Both sides work. Kill everything dead. And then once I see healer mana get better and DPS mana get better, we're gonna go pull the boss. So my friend, you're still at full rage right now, we should, but should be going in when you hit around 60. Okay. Do you want to start or shall I? I don't really mind. I could do it, I could pop that wish. I've got Kiss of the Spider and Rage ready to go as well for high throw. Alright, mine's cool. good, let's go. You can do that, I guess, if you want to. And so if it gives me in rage from getting hit on Watson. I'll take it, fine. No. I'll just let you take over the threat and not attack anymore. Spider from the front, um, one from the front, stun it, stun cross. Cool, got him stupid today. And the tank's got fawns on. Um, most of them. We've got a skull from the front again, make sure we get a stun on it. Stun it now, kill it dead. Another one coming in from the front and one behind, get square please. Stun square, stun crop, stun. I'll let you keep it, Miffy. Yeah, that's fine. Stun's we've got like eight paladins. Stun them, kill them, stun them, kill them. 
why are people dying to them? This is not how the fight works. Yeah, what you do, lads, um, is ignore the ads, just focus on the boss, then blame it on lag after. Why is that? Ah. How many pauldrons have we got now? Is it five in the last six weeks from me? Yeah, it's insane. Yeah. Alright, nature resistance gear, people, frost, re frost weapon. Thank you, what are you playing? Don't tell her. Um, he's a mega griefer who does not know what a twisting is. Hell yeah, they need the agility, they need the wind fury. Okay, good luck report them. Can we also get a summon on Mish then please ready and going? And Arya at this point as well. Also Arya, what happened to your paladin tank? Like I was playing for a four paladin fucking um, flame tongue group. Oh, uh, I just didn't want to be the fourth wheel. Just saying. Yeah. That would be pretty cool. Are we summoning Mishtem? Yep. Mishtem, say when you're here and we just go. Me and Mithram will just fight for threat. Are people clicking on the summoning portal? I might actually get there beforehand. Yeah, I think people didn't summon you at all. Listen to your raid leader and summon personal tie to summon. We're waiting for no reason here. Yeah, I made it. So we're dispelling the poison. And then if you're a healer, if you're a caster, just hit it with your frost wand in between using a few heals here or there. Like it's not a very healing intensive fight. Right. Melee attacks and it'll explode. Warriors, do make sure you spam hamstring for this one. It just does your frost procs a little bit faster. <clears throat> and get ready to AoE these globs, big AoE. Cool. Dispel poison. Poison cloud at the back of the room. That's fine. A chance we'll see. Scarabouche, scarabouche. Chance. All the shamans do make sure you're using frost shot. Just an extra frost damage source. Get out of the poison. Mercurial died due to skill issue. Who is Silifid Fema? With zero SRs. Right? Oh, no SRs, holy shit. Now, did I give this any special fun. rules? I wonder. No, I don't think I did. Good luck, gamers. If only I could use swords. Paladin tanks can also roll for like that weapon. Yeah, sadly. Even healers because of one sense. Uh, yeah, 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 true. Yeah, it's very fair. Yeah, it's, a good yeah, it's either this or the lock on in. For paladins, nothing else really. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen Lokamir in like a year almost. Yeah, sounds about right. Yeah. We're here to heal. Rat Shadow Deed. A noise from.
I was going to say, I'm surprised that's not on the loot priority list, but also kind of makes sense because it's not even a base weapon at the end of the day. I suppose it's the best cost sword to Wraith Blade. Not base, but still very good. Funky, have you got the rep on that character for those, or are you breaking the raid rules? Yep, I am friendly. Oh, already? Have you snuck into JGO's runs? <laughs> <laughs> no, I haven't. I've done a couple of AQ20s. Oh, you get and friendly I'd... really fast, though. Actually, don't. Stop from negative, fuck. He's on negative 36k. Yeah, I don't know, I think free raids is what it takes to get into the green. Free raids, you can be exalted. Nah, if you get lucky with the tokens. We do. Oh, lucky you. Alright. My friend, you want to wait out and pick up? Sure. For these packs, we're making sure we kill the marked target first prior to one before we do any AOE of any kind. Christ. I died because I was mid power shift and like spike hit. Gotta get that deep. Sleep. It really does happen every week. It's incredible. Don't worry, power shifting is gone next patch. I'm a bear. What do you mean it's gone? I was trying to get rid of the poison I had on me that gave me a movement speed slow because changing the bear form gets rid of movement decreasing that's, effects. That's true, that's true. That's just normal shifting. Um, I call it power shifting because I do it with a like two bone clips. With enthusiasm, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Alright, we've got a second pack coming in as well. I thought I had my doorbell go, but it wasn't. Also, we have so many warriors, don't underestimate the power of a lip AoE taunt. You can all do it, even if you're a DPS warrior. It just helps stabilize a lot of shit. rather white than lose CPS and this is why your warrior is not here Bartek. Alright, Bar of Peasant Call, everyone it's time to equip it. in my bags just to spam the raid with. Remember once you've used your peasant caller your aim is to take a step back from the boss so that the peasants are between the boss and you so they take the big hits. Thank you. 
you're clicking yes if you have it equipped and ready. Alright, in we go. Four, three, two, one. Who the fuck used their peasant caller on second one of the fight? Like... There are logs of this. I'll have a chat with you after this, because that's fucking retarded, okay? I'm not going to use that word too much, but like, literally listen. Hey, he just doesn't like peasants. Cause not here, you can say as much as you want. Casters use it. Melee Beware. use it. It's a macro. What, to use it whenever you target your cougar, right? No, I don't know. You know, cooldown. Someone's blew their cooldown out. That's got macro in. No! Oh, God. Keep healing people just throughout this far a little bit. Zero SRs and all this good bullshit. That's what we like to see, a zero SR drop item raid. Oh yeah. To be fair, zero SR doesn't necessarily mean they're things that people don't want, it's just that you can pick one thing out of all things you do. When there's 40 people, right, and we have the high items on a priority list, you'd expect to see some of this stuff SR. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, we are going to be marking Drew Linker as our caster stack. He has the diamond above his head. And we'll use star as the melee stack. Swap out your battle for trinkets, by the way. Yep, take off your trinkets, time. Normally coin would remind people, but he's not here, so I'm doing it. And we're gonna pull. It's firing our cane reflect. Meteor, Beware. thunderclap, range stay out. Heels on the melee. Make sure you're in a fucking stack and not making a line. We're here for a good time, right? Don't give me reasons to shout. We lost our master later to meteor. <laughs> <laughs> I'm um, Droad, go and battle resin, please. Just use a battle resin and wish them. Wait, I actually tossed the meteor all the way there. Yeah, it's happened to me before. Unlucky. Doesn't even know how to stack. What a noob. <laughs> yeah, honestly, loot Benham. Res the dead. We can actually start going forward though, getting into a position to pull. Loris, you can have your pet out for this one part, because we'll be using it to send in to pull stuff for us. The next one we'll probably be pulling is... No, to be honest. Cross. Make this stacking a bit better, please. There's a line in between, we don't want any gaps or lines. Send it into Cross. Goodbye, friend. Beware. Alright, Shadow Storm, everyone get in. Casters get in. Oh. 
Is it Lord of the Art? Yep, exploding. Only a lot of people took a lot of fire damage there. Shadow Deed, you died because you didn't get him fast enough. No, he died because uh, he was eating. Oh, oh yeah, he, he can't be teleport. eating on the pole. Oh, resin. He will teleport you underneath him and you step on you. On the droids, on Shadow Deed. Don't go AFK, Shadow Deed. You're not know saying. Alright, the next one we'll be going to pull will be square that's coming up. We'll take it here in the middle. Dolores, sending your pet on square already. He'll stop puffing towards us, but whatever makes it a little bit faster. Stop eating, stop drinking, all that good shit. Alright, fire on King reflect. Beware. Each your shadow storm casters get in. You guys aren't getting in fast enough. Alright, he's exploding. Run away. Alright, and we're gonna end up we pulling this guy because people are running around like idiots. Let's just pull it. Beware. Right, Shadowstorm, everyone gets in. We're a plague on Aloris. So Aloris can stay at range, can stay in Shadowstorm range. Ragnarok. Shadow and Frost Reflect. Terra Stomper. Run away, Exploding, girl. run away. away. <laughs> Link Sharky C just reconnected. Let's res our dead. Res, but no tango mana. Right. We haven't got everyone res, so let's not pull this. Advance forward. We'll pick it up as soon as we can. Shadow and Frost reflect. Beware. Shadow Storm, get in. Run straight now. Zero gun, you need to stop casting and just run. Shadow Storm, mate. In hard jar, get out. Cop Letty. Flurry, you just need to get max range from the side of everyone. Cool. Build it dead, everyone now just starts spreading away from the plague people. <laughs> What's making you Google? Got double execute the dodge. That's a good feeling, right? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you need some more hit chance. Yep. Mercurial is tanking tonight. Mercurial, how's your comms? You have a working microphone? Cool. So, you need to know some important things for this fight then. Because I know this is your first time. 
So the boss will typically will be on this blue circle here, and you want to get as close as you can to the middle of the boss's actual hitbox on melee out. You want to be the closest thing to the boss. Your tank, me, will most likely be here on this green circle, or further on this side here. But the actual middle of the boss will be this blue circle here. You want to be the closest thing on the teleport. When you see it flash blue, you then just run back to where you were, basically. So straight out to the side of the room, yep. And you should be avoiding the arcane explosion, which does a knock back, which can fuck a lot of things up, especially the boss's position. It's okay if it does get moved a bit, but you don't want to be getting it knocked all the way deep down into the room. You just want to be able to run in. When that teleport happens, you instantly pick up 5k threat, and then you can run back to your position and just start pumping. You need to make sure you remove Greater Blessing of Salvation. You should not have salve at all for this fight, because your aim is to generate threat. So, the blue, when you click on a mob, right, the um, hitbox will be that red circle. That blue is to represent that red circle of selecting the boss. You want to be in the center of the boss's red circle when it's teleporting. The second it has teleported, you need to run out as soon as you can because you risk getting arcane exploded. You still need to remove your salvation. Now, I want to make sure you understand this, so do ask every question you can think of, because I know it is your first time, so let's make sure you have the correct information to go for. Do you think it's worth doing a little RP for him? Oh, God. <laughs> if he's having trouble I don't know. understanding, I think like visuals might be worth I don't know, I'm not him, right? Gonna tell us, bro. If, if you don't know what's going on, we need to know because you are very fucking important in this. Yeah, yeah, like that's why I would rather explain it for four mi ten minutes than fucking just attempt it and wipe it. So, Funky, you pretend to be the boss. <laughs> I'll be tanking it. We'll be saying melee out, and when we say melee out, you need to run in onto Funky. So, melee out. Funky, make your hands and feet glow. Yeah, you're there. Cool. And now he's teleported. Big blue flash on the screen, you run out. Don't backpedal though, you need to fucking run. So come back in, it's melee out. Teleport successful. Perfect. Perfect. Cool. And then when it's melee out and you're tanking the shadow guy, I will be running in front of you, so I need to be the closest one to the boss. And then that means I get the 5k threat. That's basically how it works. Whoever is the closest to the center of the boss's hitbox gets the threat. Moonchan is checking on his cat. But if you aren't comfortable with that, click no on this ready check. If everyone's ready, click yes. Uh, please put me, JC, and uh, Merc on the same group. Um, Rikaidos, you can set that up. We definitely want to make sure the correct shadow tanks are in the right groups, right? So yeah, for grounding is is big. It's gonna help massively. So about those two, Mithrin, and we should take out the Lake Sharky. Who's the healer for that one? I think it's Zayamara, right? Yeah, I'm on the on the left side. Cool. So you should be in the same group as Mithrin for grounding totem, because that will take out wave one of the shadow bolts, which is always good. Perfect lightning's in gear for backup, and we also need to make sure people are prioritizing the scarabs that get enraged. But no players at AFK, everyone is ready, so we're good to pull. Bartek, it's time for your favorite time. Oh, sorry, I've not actually said which healers are where. I have posted it, but like, I'm just going to say it out loud. Me Meme Chan, Zaramara, Poem are on Mifrin and Bartek. Fire, Shiro, and Rakaidos are on me and Mercurial. But I need to. Nope, everything's good, cool. Bartek needs a priest shield, please. Yeah, one sec. Okay, go on in. My god, he said it. My god. Ah. Lambs to the slaughter. 
Your brash arrogance. That's good. You guys can start. Ten. Melee out. Three, two, one. Mercurial, you weren't in the fucking boss's hitbox, so it's on me. You need to build a threat to pull it off of me, and I need heals. I'm not actually angry, I'm just explaining what went wrong. Alright, you got it now. Back up a little bit. Ten. Um, so, Liana, you pulled fret. And that just means we need to reposition it. Three, two, one. Be very careful here, Millie. Mm -hmm. Alright, it's melee out. It is healing right now, by the way, so, like, all the damage is pointless. So, Liana, are you trolling? Please don't. Mages, you're on a frostball duty. If you can't control ignite, you're frostballing. I need fucking heals. Ten. Alright, melee out. Three, two, Mercurial, one. Mercurial, stand in the middle of it. Perfect. Wait for the blue flash and go. It's on your pet, but that's fine. You should be stepping a little bit further away from it, though you're in arcane explosion range. Ten. Melee out. Three, two, one. Mercurial, you'll just stand somewhere on the steps, you don't need to run. Ten. Do you want to evade when you're not tanking this point? Um, can Alay give you it instead, please? Give what, sorry? Shiro yeah, and evade. Sure thing. Ten. Melee out. Three, two, one. Ragnarok, get the fuck out! Let me guess, like. Yep, Mercurial, you need to step back from that point. Like, you run out, don't just stand there. But you're doing good so far learning, it's just a practice, it's a res. Ten. Alright, and some Bartek. Three, two, some Mercurial again. One. Whoever has aggro, try and just run all the way to the wall so it runs towards the wall a bit more instead of healing. Gonna need some heavy heals on Mitchell, maybe? Your oh, Bartek's there. Alright. Oh, it's back to 70%. Ten. Melee out. Three, two, Material, one. Material, make sure you're in the middle of the hitbox. Further in, Mercurial. Closer than me. Nope, fucked up. JC down. No one arrest. Kind of. Yeah. Ten. Melee out. Three, two, one. Yeah, he needs to be one pixel in front, but like I'm seeing him very far, much further away than me. That's why I'm telling him to get to the middle, because it's harder to argue against that one. Ten. Ten. 
May I lay out? Three, two, one. That mercurial. He did just get blasted to the Shadowlands. Ten. Melee, get out. Be careful, Melee. It's in a dodgy position. Three, two, one. Wait for the teleport. Ten. Got the hang of the melee. Get out. Three, two, one. Yep, you're good there. Wait for the blue flash, and then you're just running straight out. Go. Perfect. What's he done? You should aim to try and get back on the stairs because it gives you a good distance away. But like, that's exactly what you want me doing, mate. We should heal a bit more, get a bit more practice, I'm joking. Ten. <laughs> no. I could heal this for twelve more hours. <laughs> With these five druids, sure. Melee Three, out. Two. One. If you can kill, you can kill, but respect. Yep. Get it, boys. No, it wasn't the cleanest attempt, but it was a one-time, one yeah. attempt, right? No! Like, that's what counts. Yeah, I had no faith whatsoever. And we killed it, so well done. Ooh! Ah. Yeah. Wow. Hey. <laughs> oh, I've already got that enchant. Oh, it's the rake. No way, it dropped the deed of hand there. Sorry. I think one of Mercurial was there, so in the second one was actually my fault. I was too slow to put the shield on him, so I'll take mm -hmm. part of the play for that. Um, Mercurial actually died because he was just too close and got hit by Arcane Explosion. Well, actually, uh, basically. actually, I think one of your deaths is partly my fault as well, Jordan, to be fair, I wasn't quick enough. Um, my death was I got knocked deep in the room, it's no one's fault for that. It's just yeah, no, unluckiness. But, but what I should be doing really is like doing a greater heal sort of like ahead of time on the ball because there uh, sometimes you can get hit a couple of times very quickly and you're almost dead. See, so, yeah, that was a bit sloppy on my part too, in fairness. That said, we have a lot of faith in Mercurial for next time he has to do it, at least. Yeah, great job. Yeah, that's fine. It is difficult at first to sort of get the radius spot on, but yeah, you've got the hang of it. Alright, groups are reset. Um, Alorius, I need you to be very proactive with your pet at this point. We need to make sure we can pull these packs. Wait, wait. Oh, you're clearing, not skipping. Always. Yeah, I think like, you've been I, I, I've, I've been clear. doing. I've been doing too much ADO runs. I forgot. I haven't played for like <laughs> months. We're not. Really. <laughs> I literally walked really all over to the next boss. <laughs> going back, don't worry. Oh yeah. I'm taking a champion. Yep. I'm going. To, we stack up the slayers. We kill the slayers first. CCJC and mind control. Yep, Curse of Agony and Corruption. That's my favorite. <laughs> Kill the Slayers first, pull the Mind Slayers off into different corners and directions. Go three Mind Slayers, I'll mark one and pull it away. I could move and do damage while being the Mind Flight. But the mobs ignore me. I don't know. Alright, skull's in a good position to kill. Both will be, never mind. Don't kill the skull, don't kill the skull. Oh, gosh. Moon is going to fear the whole raid next. 
I can't wait. We have a new moon. Immune to taunt. You stop it. Do you remember that? Why you stopped taking it? <laughs> Yeah. I could still move while being mind controlled and hit, but no mobs hit me when I was drop threat. I don't know. That was weird. Alright, that could have went worse. <laughs> Who's ready for the full mind slayer pack? I'm fistering um, them from the back, it's okay. Wait, there's a um, No, you're pack. gonna get a second pack. You wanna find somewhere to shadow meld, mate. Nah, I'm alright. Just, just. Type one, two, three. Alright. Send your pet into this one. Yeah. If Winter's rolled highest, you could have had it. He does give us free enchantments. <laughs> Alright, pick up these slayers, kill them dead. All the mind slayers are two separate hidden areas and just kill them dead. All melee DPS go straight onto the champion. And casters, you start with moon and then you go for the one in the doorway, please. Melee DPS, stay off of the Mind Slayer as it's about to die. There's a reason we're killing it far away from everybody, it's because they do an AoE fear on death. Wait, they do? No, I'm making that bullshit up as I go along, mate. I, uh. I'm skeptical about that. <laughs> Get these scorpions no dead, please. That was the wrong AoE. Alright, and it's a load of mind slows. So let's have some fun. We just want to pull them off into a square, basically. Because there's going to be a lot of fears to be had. Alright, so... Melee, your aim is to get them all to 50% please. Okay, who the fuck is moving this one back and forth while I'm trying to find position to park my... Alright, casters, you don't want to kill Skull. Moon is in the perfect place to actually be killed. If all casters start focusing on them. Skull quickly. It had one hit left on it. I was hoping to kill it before it killed me. Larry, I think what happened is I was looking for a place to run. I saw where you were, so I started running in the other direction, and then you started running because you saw me coming towards you. Fucking Benny Hill music or what, mate? Quick <laughs> <laughs> T-Bang and Martin. Quick. Okay. Got four seconds. Ah, oh, fuck. 
I missed him out of Tinte. But he's so far away. Too slow, losers. Alright, and we just dance up together as a group. Is that, is that oh. three, four times monster, isn't it? Really? Yes, yeah. it's the exact same trash that we just had to deal with. Good. So. Pick them up, make a square of them elsewhere, just so they're spread out. I'm going to pull Skull to a position where it should be fine to kill it and it won't affect all the raid. Melee get off of Skull at this point. Cast this, start blasting it, get your dots on it. Alright, kill Skull. Skull is kill. Do the Paladins, so if you're not getting any heals at all. They can learn hands. We want to kill Triangle next, it's the next one in a good position. Well, not Triangle, no. Um, you could learn hands. After that we go for Skull, because Skull is further down the hallway. We leave cross alone, leave cross the fuck alone. Oh, I'm <laughs> I can't even shower Winters today, he's not in comms. Where's the bear? Yeah. He's getting killed. Right. Trying to save him. Killed. Oh, it's line of sighting the shit. Yeah, you're doing what you need to do, mate. Yeah, but <laughs> I couldn't be in, in line of sight. He was dropping to 20% HP. Uh, I even I even popped Berserk just to survive. Yeah, that's so <laughs> You know, I, I was playing too much retail. I thought I could kill it alone. 7k HP. No, We've mate, been blessed. A mate. single Slayer. Ooh, let's go, boys! We're eating well. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's spread out these mine slaves though, please. They're all currently tightly grouped. Alright, Moon is running back into the group currently, so we don't want to be targeting Moon for now. We're just going to accept the fears and stop shouting at people. There we go. I can do it. Sure. These packs are Something's got to give, right? Just stack them together, cleave them down. No one died in the pack, that's a plus. like to inform with regret, there have been no red mans. They do Yet. drop, don't worry. Twin We've had like Ferrari. five in one run before. That's absolute bullshit. <laughs> it's not. Seven. No, nine. Sad boy, it's been weeks since I've died in these fucking raids. I'm popping the fuck off in here. I haven't died in like three weeks in these AQs. He's playing the correct. That's uh, about to change. Let's You're go. right, I said shit. Just stack it up, kill it dead, pull it down the tunnel because we're stacking it all together at this point because I've stopped caring. I'll grab him more. Did I give you assistance so you can mark something? I say to stack all of you guys spread them out. What is going on? Perfect. 
satisfaction. Fuck you. That's what. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the captain now. Right. <laughs> Alrighty, we do our patented. We just pull this one guy and hope it doesn't shit everything up. Oh, we have area today? Well, luxury. But she can make choose this. Of course, of course. Alright, we aim to hit this one for zero. Everyone stack up on me. I hope I'm in the right Five, range. Five, four, three, two, one. Alright, make sure you hit it. I see people not precasting. I love to see that. And I think we learned we can pull this one? No. Without... No. We learned we cannot. Oh, okay. Just no, try, there was just definitely... try this thing. Yeah, fuck it. I mean, the raid, just we're try already it. not listening to the raid. <laughs> just try it. See? Oh. Um, that was, yeah, a, that was a very premature <laughs> speed. <laughs> Alright, everybody, focus I'm sure we'll on the next please. Week. Less damage on the cross. Yeah, we'll try again next week, mate. We need a lot more damage on the cross. Unless you're a mark. <laughs> they don't give a shit. Alright, we're gonna pull whichever pack we get next, just all straight back into this room, stack them all together, kill them all dead. So, Aloris, feel free to send your pet into any of them. Surely not. Don't call he me can't surely. Hear you. You'll give the mob gold, is it? Yep. Fair enough. Yep, that's fine. We'll deal with it. Get these slayers down. Recall all of your totem pack. We have the second champion now. Someone take this take a second champion. Yep, I've picked it up. Is it an AoE tremor? Yes, an AoE fair, yeah. Okay. It's not the biggest I'll range. Put, I'll put it to the opposite wall then. There it is. Cool. Keep the palings alive if you want to live. There's one slayer left, and then it's just all mine slayers. Um, innovate Shiro, please. Yeah, back -back packs like this are very humanity. Just need a token whenever you want. Slays together, kill them dead. This way, a tank isn't affected by the fear. I didn't realize we were strong enough to handle two of these packs at once, by the way. 
and you can stack in there. Let's not do that again. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's great for my part, bro. <laughs> Chain heal go. <laughs> I mean, the fastest raid time you can get is skipping it all, but like, we've been here for about 10 minutes, so it's not going too bad. Alright, we need to wait for mana because mana is shit. And we just rest three people and then we buff them too, so. At morning you stars. Just so you know, we kill all of the trash and then we deal with all the Runka fun straight after each other. Just so people don't get out of the habit of how to deal with it. Uh, that's Ari buffs. Hit for zero. Five, four, three, two, one. and trash is beneath him. I have a suggestion. Yeah? Turtle Wow team. A spell called Piercing Meow. Oh, I love that. It's, it's fucking brilliant, mate. Piercing Meow. Five. It does what four, piercing cow does three, for warriors, I guess. Two. Help one. with boss mobs because it's a man. <laughs> and it can be only used at capital. It sacrifices bears to enter capital. <laughs> That's like healthy gameplay for bear. Hell yeah. Catch it. Ah, yes, because cats don't have the power shift enough. Exactly. I know, Gus. What's up? Yeah, Morning, bro. That's completely fine, but you won't be welcome back in the future. What a fucking cunt. <laughs> yeah, I don't agree on killing everything else that people are doing. Or respecting the raid leader, yeah. Like, this is how we've always run the AQ40 here. We've not really changed it. We don't really plan to change it. If you aren't comfortable killing the trash packs, then go make your own raid. Like, that's the simple and short of it. All raid elsewhere that does is fine with that. But, like, we get through it pretty quickly. That's been about 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Like, it's a pretty nice raid overall. Okay, so I need our big dick caster mages to pay attention. We are all stacking together behind the boss if we are a DPS. If you are high on the threat table, this means you're within like 10k from the tank. You're spreading out on the left and right side from the stack at the back of the boss. This is because of how the new sandblast mechanics works. It goes to whoever has the highest numerical threat on Oru at the time that he is about to cast sandblast. So if Mithrin has been sweeped out and his threat isn't showing on the table anymore, it will go for the highest mage in pre -zone. Our ideal situation is though that Mithrin or myself just um, gets a uh, resist, resist to the Sandblast. Because that just makes it a whole lot easier. <clears throat> so it's time to pop a Nature Protection Potion. You'll be using a Lucidity Potion. Um, at around 20% boss health, and he's just doing his um, popcorn bullshit at all times. We're getting some new oranges out, and we'll have a fun time. Quotation marks. This boss is pretty fun, to be honest. You just need to know how to run away at the right time. I, I do like it better now than before. I didn't at first, but that's just because mm. I didn't understand. But this is the one time I'll do a ready check and we'll do one just before fun. 
That's because these are the only three hard bosses in this raid, to be honest. Morning Brew is not ready. Do not understand the tactic of running away from the stack if you're highest on threat. In terms of numerical number, have you not got a threat meter? That's a very important one to self-report about. Oh, by the way, if Lake Shark skis offline, I can put Elleris in Group 2 so they get True Shot Aura as well. Um, Morning Brew, you're not ready. Mercurial, you're not ready. Lake Shark, he is offline. Yeah, Lake Shark skis been on off all evening because I'm back in the Yeah, he's had internet issues. He's DM me about it. I've just not had a chance yeah. to actually read a reply. Um... Morning Brew, we're waiting on you. What's wrong? Why aren't you ready? Cool. Mithra and I'll load to start up. You're on the left for this one. Okay. I don't tank often, so when I do, I may as well put myself as the main character. Of course. First Sandblast and Sweep. Sandblast on Winters. Melee get out for Sweep. There's the Sweep. Resisted, Sandblast on me. Resisted, that's what we like to see. He's nuts. You did set up the legend play. necklace. <laughs> yeah, I said it was the only correct play, that's why I wear this. It's the lucky talisman. Sound blast on me. Yep. Nope. What a noob, can't even resist three. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So Le Mifrin's next person to get sandblasted, then it looks like so Liana after that. Yep. Run away, little girl. Sand blast on Mifrin. Run away. Ready, stand where Mifrin was, please. Oh, yeah, yeah. Run away, little girl. Run away. <laughs> <laughs> I had four of them on me, man. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, melee are so gifted. Cool. Um, yeah, when you submerges, you want to run away as soon as you can. Big Quicks helps, because I ain't going to call out everything that happens. Get to the center of the room for the re-emerge. We want to be able to pick up all of the artists prior to one, please. Beware. I have AoE taunted the one certain enemy. We need a tank on Oru, ASAP. Mifrin, can that be you? Yeah. Thank you. All the ads are almost dealt with. Perfect. And tanks start getting onto a side again. Town Blast coming out now, it's going to be hitting Mifrin. Or it's not. It's going to be on Mifrin, so cool. Next one already, GC, Terror Stomper. It'll be on Terror Stomper next. Yeah. Beware! Just got no rage. Oh, Alright, next one's right gonna be on me. If you can both not get hit by the same one, that'll be great. While tech get around to the side of the room, start for go into the side of the room, please. You can lucidity now if you want to live. Sartre, be away from everyone else. You are the highest numerical threat. And kill it dead. Nice. Alurcia says this is hard. Decent. No arrest us. Alright. 
we can just make the dead fucking run back in and use the teleport because it'll be faster overall. If they don't need loot, maybe, or... Yeah, if you don't need loot. Give me a plus in chat if you want rest. Yeah, that's a good idea. Otherwise, just get the hell out of here. I can't type for shit. Well... <laughs> It's the regular two tokens as well as the item that was SR. That's it. Remember, hug the wall opposite Kafun's doorway when you approach. Set by release, I can't reset. That's fine. We told people to bring us. Oh, okay. Like, if they don't need anything, they can teleport and skip having to run oh, yeah, the yeah. opposite side of the door. Yeah, of course, yeah. Fair enough. The teleporter is the NPCs you turn stuff in. The one on the far left hand side, the small gnome, you can talk to them and get teleported to whatever it's called. The final chamber. That's the one. And then we can get everyone rebuffed up, make sure everyone is good to go. Shadow Rose buff is nice. Is Hazel listening in? You betray your friends. He is. Quick, stop talking about it. Uh, that. Didn't know we had a full year on our hands. Right, let me post the same old screenshot that we post every week. So pay attention to your group numbers. If you are in group one, then you are in position one on the image. And when there is a dark glare, which is the big red eye beam, you need to group eight's position. Yeah. And then you spread out from there again and have fun. Same for group two, you swap with group seven, etc, etc. You see the swap in the top left of the image. Use your own brains, because that's why you have them. Now, you may be wondering, but I'm a melee in a full melee group. What do I do? Where do I stand? You don't have to worry about that. I assign eight of you guys to be melees on Kafun, and the rest of you just find somewhere to stand and don't cause any trouble. Because that's all you need to do is survive phase one. In phase two, we'll go through it a little bit further. But the gist of it is you just stun stuff, kill stuff, and only kill the inside tentacles when you're told to kill them. So, who are our lucky guys today who get to actually be inside of Kafun? Well, give me a second to find out. Ah, balls. One, two, three, four, five. Your friends will abandon you. That should be eight. Now, you need to make sure you're using the fun add-on and spreading out. It's your own responsibility to not kill each other. 
you start training, it's because you're just bad at the game and you don't know how you're playing. And that's okay, but like, them. Um, and just to make sure we spice things up a little bit. Drafers, Droad and Shadow Deed, find a wall and stare at it. Because Skafum Warner is not telling me you guys have it installed. So you get the wall treatment. You just need to run on Dark Glare and you can use your range abilities on the Ice Stalks. But otherwise you're basically just finding a spot away from everybody else and standing there in shame. Now, if everyone's ready and everyone's buffed up, like yes. I believe we have two different healer groups. That's group five and group eight, and they're decently spread Your out around the room. Will abandon two in group five. Only two in group five. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, Mr. We'll Shadow. Been I'll swap um, Poem and Alosius. Um. So group eight gets the Shadow Priest and the Resto Druid. Okay. We're just making sure people are spread out, Gus. But like we can play about with the groups later on after we get past phase one. You know, we can give you back the Shadow Priest. Yeah, unless it's healing, miss them shadow. Oh yeah, there's only one Shadow Priest. So it's not Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. I'm confused myself. Yeah. You. Yeah, I was confused oh, too because I'm used to being yeah. shadow. Yeah, but sorry. I'm spreading misinformation. Everyone is ready, but I need someone to pull Aloris. Come over to Star, please. Put on all of your nature resistance gear. We give you a shield. Aloris. If your name was not called out by me, that is these people. You are not to be attacking the boss. Loris, put on your nature resistance gear as much of it as you have. We're going to give you a pre-shield. And then you're going to take the first few hits. You're running straight through to the back of the room. And that's when we say pull. After he's got started running in, everyone else starts chasing off behind. I'm going to give a seven second pull timer. This is for Loris. We go two seconds after he's gone. Five, four. Remember, you can three, feign death to change two, back to normal gear. One. Loris, go. Everyone else, go. It's been one. Two. Just now, random. Spread out. Praying. Make sure you're fucking spreading out, people, and not running around. Ein Hajar, there's space for you to stand elsewhere. You're just stacking close to people. Now. There's space on the entrance side of the eye for melee DPS. Alright, tentacle party and dark glare happening. Dark glare is in group one's position of the room. And it's going clockwise. Remember, run to your next position as soon as you can, and then you can start damaging the boss big time. We make sure we kill all tentacles that spawn, they just do the damage that we don't need. Zero gone, you died because you didn't run away from the beam, you won't be getting the battle rest. Alright, get these tentacles down, next central party just happened. Tentacles are still up guys, kill them, get them yep. kicked. What? Sat boy, you owe me your life. Right, Moon Chan's been killed. Was that from chaining or something else? Okay, 
We will battle Resmian champions. Run away, little girl. Run away. Get ready for dark glare. Pay attention to where the eye's opening. And everyone to the north of the room. Get these tentacles down for tentacle party. And everyone to the north of the room. Spread out in the north. Use the um, left side and right side of the north. But everyone be up here behind this line on the floor. Right, Giant Claw has spawned directly in the middle. We need a tank on it ASAP. When the Giant Eye Tentacle spawns, we want to make sure we're stunning these as priority one and interrupting them. We don't want it to cast anything, otherwise we're going to have a bad time. And whoever goes inside, start working down on the left tentacle, which would be the first tentacle, and just get the right one low. We'll call out when to kill the right one, when it's a good time, so we can try and one-phase this. Judgment of Wisdom on boss, please, helps mm -hmm. for Giant Eye spawned and I've got a stun on it. Let's interrupt. Um, yep, can we get a battle res on Droad, please? Resting. Right, everyone make sure we're spreading out in the north of the room. Stop going so deep down. We don't want to be this close to Kafun. Unless you're trying to get an Annihilator stack up or Sunder. First tentacle inside is dead, second one is on 75%. Get the second one low, I will call out when we kill it. Alright, we have a giant eye spawning now, stop damage on that second tentacle. Get these tentacles in the back of the room dead. Kill the tentacle inside, please. Everyone get to the back of the start entrance of the room. That's the weak point of the boss. Get as much damage in it as we can. Use your fucking cooldown to pump it. We can one phase this. We have 35 seconds. Potems at the back, please. 20 seconds, pump as hard as you can guys. Let's one phase it. Not today, but real fucking close. Everyone back to the north of the room. We just need to push the inside tentacles whenever we can. Giant Claw spawned on the left side. Well, everyone back to the north of the room. If you get sent inside, just start focusing down the tentacles. I don't care if you're a tank or a healer. At this point, we just want to kill them. First tentacle inside is dead. Get these eye tentacles down and we just had a giant claw spawn. Kill that second tentacle inside please. We can literally hold this giant claw while we kill the boss. He's got 40k health left pretty much. That's literally less health than a giant claw has. Push. Right, everyone kill the boss. It'll literally be five seconds and he's dead. Beautiful. That's what we love to see, people. Good job. Tentacle. I deserve it. It's mine. Uh, have you died this raid? Last um, week we had it so where it went to I haven't died two lie. weeks in a row. Check the fucking logs. 
belongs. Jack. Hmm. That is disrespectful. You're goddamn right, it's aggressive. I deserve it. Crash, you like 